welcome back to the channel and welcome back to our Red Dead Redemption arc period. We're in our Red Dead Redemption era of the channel, okay? We're in the intermediary period between Red Dead 2 and Red Dead 1. And as soon as I posted the Red Dead 2 final chapter, the final video of our journey with Arthur, I got 5 million, approximately 5 million comments, no exaggeration, of... Uh, People telling me that I missed the end credits scenes and that I'm the worst person ever and I skipped them and I hate everybody. And although you may be right and I do hate you all, <laughs> just kidding, <laughs> I don't hate you all. It was an accident. I just want to say it was an accident. I didn't know there were end credits scenes. I just was like, wow, this was a really great game. And I stopped the recording. That was it. That was it was that deep. So what I'm doing now in order to make up for my sins is watch the end credits scene with you all so you guys can get my reaction as to what happens when the game is over. I will say, though, this is kind of counterintuitive because I've already started Red Dead 1. I've already filmed the first video. So at this point in time, I've filmed about two hours worth of content for Red Dead Redemption 1, so I'm not super far into the game. But just so you guys know, during those two hours, there are multiple times where I'm like, what the fuck is going on? Who are these people? Where is John going? Where is Abigail? What happened to the gang? So all of these questions could have been simply answered if I had just watched the end credits scene that I didn't know existed. So I just want to put that out there. I'm a real person, okay? I fucked it up on accident and it's just a game and nothing really matters anyway. So we're going to watch the end credits. Enjoy me being confused in the first episode of Red Dead 1. And then uh, from there on, we're all going to be caught up. So without further ado... Oh, I've got my kafife. I'm ready to watch a eight minute long video with you all. Let's get into it. I also muted it because I don't know if there's going to be copyright music and I really just don't give a shit and feel like dealing with that. Okay, so I'm going to be narrating. Tree. Okay, I saw this part. I saw this part. That they actually got hitched. Well, that was going to be a given anyways. You know, everyone was there. How sweet. He proposed. I mean, I guess not. They could have died because this is a brutal game, but. Okay. Okay. Aw. Also just realized that my camera's on like the wrong side because I'm looking that way. So we're just going to go over here. Whoa. Yup. This is where it all happened. We shot the rat. Okay. Yup. These guys. The bowler man. Yeah, so I remember these guys showing up in Red Dead 1. God damn it! Okay. No. All right, so Charles went on his merry way. As he said he wanted to do, he wants to find a woman and settle down or try to. Because John's domesticated lifestyle was appealing to him all of a sudden. What is this? Oh? Our girl, Mary Beth. Writing. Good for her, dude. Not the other Mary. Oh my god, the pooch is still alive. Thank god. That was traumatic. Hmm. Valentine. The guys. They're looking for John, it looks like. Or 
Previous members of the gang? Why do they care who is responsible for Micah's death? Like, who cares about Micah? No, oh, Tilly! Good for her, dude. Hmm. Are those the detectives rolling through roads? Got Pearson. This little general store. Oh, I was expecting a discount when we rolled through here. I'm not going to lie to y'all. Ah, The whole gang. Mm-hmm. Why do they care? Micah was a rat. Did he have, like, high connections or something? No, say taking off. I'm glad she survived. She had the lumbago. What's out here? Are they still looking? Uh, blessed are those who hunger and thirst for righteousness. Oh! Oh, Mary, Mary! The one that got away that she never actually had. God, that must feel so hollow. Because she sent him off and she didn't really get to say a proper goodbye. That's fucked. Oh. Yep. Mm-hmm. No, they're just like tying together all the nature of the game. <laughs> it's got like circle of life vibes, just how everything is still happening. The world is still turning, you know? Oh, snap, brains fall. Just overseeing the world.
what an epic way to wrap up the series. Not only did they tie in what happened to the rest of the gang members pretty much, um, they also set up for the first game because as I have already mentioned, I'm very confused in the first chapter of like, what is going on in this game? Now it makes sense while he, why he's being followed by those two guys. They're trying to track down what happened there. So I'm sure it'll all make sense more and more as Red Dead 1 unfurls, but just wanted you guys to know that now I've watched the end credit scene. Uh, it was beautifully done. Uh, thank you all for watching our Red Dead journey, and I'm looking forward to continuing with Red Dead 1. I'll see you guys over there. See ya!